Hi, this is an overview of iDesarvey CAT interface. The CAT interface is the one used by phone agents to collect data through phone calls. They will enter the interface with a username and password, and this is the window that they will see. This is the working space of the, of the phone agents. On top, he has the information on the person that is calling. In this case, I have a name, a surname, and a phone number. You can associate multiple phone numbers to the same person, and uh, ID Survey is able to manage outcomes and appointments for each one of these numbers. In the main part of the page, you have what we call the introduction text, which is the text that you can customize for the interviewer to read when starting the phone call. And then in the bottom part of the page, you have the three main buttons to uh, set the outcomes of the call. The red one is for definitive outcomes, so if you have to mark an incorrect number or a refusal. And in this case, the contact is screened out of the uh, interview and you have a new one to call. The post button is to set other type of outcomes, which are temporary. You have, for example, the appointment, which allow you to set an appointment for the uh, interviewer to call back the same person in another day and time. And when you schedule an appointment, the interviewer is able to decide if you want to reserve the appointment, so only the same interviewer is able to see this contact, or if it's not reserved, then any interviewer available at that date and time is able to take the call and call the contact. In that same button, you also have the possibility to send a preset email for the respondent to complete the interview via web. The last button is the green one, which is the one to start the interview. So when the uh, interviewer clicks on it, he will start the questionnaire that you created on the admin interface. In any moment, if the survey is set as uh, both an inbound and outbound uh, survey, you can click on the um, interviewer icon and the interviewer can switch to inbound or outbound according to the uh, methodology that is set. For the inbound, uh, the interviewer is able to search in the contacts list for a specific parameter, for example, the name or surname or any other thing, and the software will suggest the contacts that are met matching the uh, parameter that I'm inserting. And if I click on the name of one of the contact and then on select, I can start the phone call with this specific number. By default, the standard type of calls is the click to dial. So I'm clicking on the number and the system is dialing the, the same number. Uh, you can also use ID Survey with predictive dialing along with uh, our own dialer ID Talk. Um, on the top left, you find the uh, little icon, which is the settings for the interviewer. These settings that you display depends on what you set on the admin interface. So the admin interface has the full control on the uh, CATI interface and you decide what to display or not according to the survey or the interviewer. Now, if I move back to the admin interface, which is this one, uh, I'm right now in the settings section, which is where I can decide uh, how to set my survey. And in this specific moment, I'm on the CATI tab, which is the tab to set everything related to CATI surveys. For example, you can set the introduction text that we've seen before, you can set reasons of refusals, you can set call settings, which includes calls in time frame or attempts or delays time. And down below, you also have the possibility to preset an email template or an SMS template to send uh, through the CATI interface the link to complete the questionnaire via web. In the admin interface, you are also able to use other tools that are related to CATI. For example, you can set filters for the uh, interviewers, for an agent, so that you assign to them just specific contacts according to parameters that you decide um, related to your preferences. Uh, that's all for this CATI overview. If you want to know more on ID Survey, you can visit our website, idsurvey.com, and request a demo. Thanks for watching. Ciao.